Word. Now, in my opinion, heavy bag speaking, and I'm probably going to get killed for this. Y'all are the two top females in the game right now. No debating to me. You know what I mean? Two on twos. A lot of two on twos going on. Jazz and official. Would y'all ever take two on two dudes, females, anything? Is that something maybe we could work on or what? <laughs> like two on two, like I, that's cool with me. She already said no. That's cool with me. That's cool with me. I, I'd rather do a two on two, two, two with two. someone like C three though. Like I just feel like that performance or whatever. But if it's not something that's really interested, but if someone was to come and like yo, you and Jackson two on two, I accept it. Like I won't turn it down. I just uh, a rather different she opponent. right now because somebody <laughs> asked that. She said, I said, no, not interested. I'm not interested. Right, but but I would take jazz. You try, to, you try to beat around the bush this time. <laughs> Don't beat I'm around not the bush. interested, but I'll take jazz if it was offered to me. Uh, Period. Uh, it's not beating around the bush. Uh, it's cool. Like, I just would rather someone who's like Tori or a, a C3 with more performance than Russia. Well, well, yo, um, last question. Let y'all leave. Um, you are out. You know what I'm saying? What's next? You know, I know you want to hustle. Where does this leave you, Jazz? I mean, you know, do you want to take somebody, you know, quickly and, you know what I'm saying? Also, being that you did do what you did to 40, you know, and now, you know, you you took your really first clear loss in the building, you know, does this make your stock go down? And are you still going to take them top tier girls or maybe give a rookie a shot? Or, you know, where does this leave you? Battle at this point, I'm giving a shot. Period. So, I already wanted to battle twice or three times this year. I already wanted that. It didn't matter after a fish I wanted somebody. You battled in May. That's seven more months in the whole year. I wanted somebody else. But, um, unfortunately, I definitely would not do that because they would die. Like, we gotta be honest with you. A rookie with God versus me. Um, they could battle. I feel like any girl, they gotta battle somebody that I at least battled, or there's somebody that's a little under me, like to, to prove that you can do it. Because at the end of the day, I'm giving you a shot. I don't gotta do it. If I beat you, I beat you. If you beat me, you the greatest. Like you know what I'm saying, like well, well. with her, she we discussed it already. You feel like she beat me, now it's like, oh, official number one. So that's when I, that's what's gonna happen if you no, battle me. I don't feel like if, if like if you used to battle my verse and she was to beat you, they wouldn't be like, oh my verse is number one. They definitely would. You're bugging. You're bugging. If you they clearly, definitely would not clearly, say that, Jack. If you clearly be, if you if like you, to be number one, you can't just it's not about me just beating you. That is like I still have the stuff that number ones have. Like my verse could beat you, but she still don't have the resume, the all of that to be called a number one check. Resume, no that matter. don't mean she's number if one. You she beat you. Just a Rapper? You're not number one because you're a rookie. It don't matter. You mean tell me my verse is number one because she beat you? No. If my verse would have stood, no. would have stood in front of me or known five and rap what you did and did what she did, my verse would be number one. You could have been Couture. I disagree. That could have been Tori Doe. That could have been that could have been E Heart. That could have been C the Boss. Niggas would have been like, oh shit, this person beat Jazz. And mind you, it's not like I was slacking. It's not like I was like trash. I gave you three good rounds. If you would have beat me on where I'm on my shit, it would have been they would have been number one. They would have been ranked way higher than what they are. Definitely, but number one is a big jump from not going from top five to number one. Yeah, but if you go from Joe Snow to Jazz, that means something. And then you beat me at that. I don't agree. But um, nah. Now, I'll, now, now, but, as far as the rookie though, no. I but um, um, it's the same. Like it didn't matter. Honestly, it didn't matter what would have happened with the uh, official battle. I still would have been battling top five because I'm Jazz. Like it, I just have that ranking, so I'm not. I can give a rookie a shot. Yes, I can, but I don't have to. They can battle somebody else that's lower than me. It's a lot of people lower than me. It's a lot of nice girls lower than me. You can get through them, and let's see how you do with that. Like I just feel like I, I like a lot of the rookies, and I just feel like it, it takes a lot of experience and you know season to to, to be like that. So I I wouldn't battle a rookie at this point, no. But to wrap this up. Um, 
you know, who who is a, is a, is an opponent that you know you feel as though like you would take like she wants hustle. You know what I mean? Who who do you want to make your comeback battle against? I mean, they saying Gaddis, they saying E Hart. You know what I mean? Who would be Jazz's comeback battle on URL? <laughs> and, and, and it was gonna be. The, it was. It didn't matter about a comeback. It, it, it was after official. It would have been either of them too. Mm -hmm. Period. That hasn't changed though. No. Cool. It didn't matter what. It didn't matter what was gonna happen in that battle. If she would have bodied me like three zero, and I would have pulled the forty and just not rap, I still would have been able to battle E Hart. E Hart not gonna say no to me. Yeah, it's not gonna say no to me. It so just, you think if you would have got body three zero like you did versus forty, E Hart would still take you? Yes, she would. Cause who else is she gonna take? Gonna take. Huh? Who? Who? Exactly. You I know, think he's just gassing it a little bit. You know okay. about E Hart gonna take a tour? I think like, E Hart being a tour gonna be better than being me. I just think he's gassing it. You know, uh, also, you was originally supposed to take a tour at Gladiator School. Right. You know, possibility? I mean, I know you don't want to battle her, but it's a possibility. I don't mind battling. I don't mind battling anybody, honestly. But if if the chicken right, I don't mind at all. But if the chicken ain't right, I'm gonna move accordingly. You gotta be somebody that's a top girl. E Hart is higher than Goddess for the simple fact that me and E Hart battle on the same schedule once a year. Right, right. And she's like, she gets the most respect. Goddess. Kind of lost her respect when she did that shit versus E Hart and NHB. And then the hustle battle was debatable. But um, E Hart got that right now. E Hart got it right now. She battled E Hart and that is school. It's debatable for the most part. So E Hart, e -Hart still got that. Word, you word. Know, OG now, shit. now, oh, you know, if for whatever reason the hustle battle can't happen or. You know, something like that. Who would who would be your your next move? I mean, forty. Forty? Yeah, she did though. Like this battle really determined a lot. Like I really was going to move with the forty situation. She did really go for definitely forty. Other than that, I don't really see like nobody else. I really want to take. Right. Well, yo, I'm gonna let y'all go, man. Take some pictures with the fans and shit, man. Thank you for the time. Jazz official. Yo, who the only fucking media outlet getting to fit um fucking exclusives like this, man? 15 minutes of fame. Flatline in the build. He didn't say it. You are now listening to 15 minutes of fame radio. Let's go! 15 minutes of fame radio. Now stepping into 15 minutes of fame radio. Fucking jam right there.